Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. It's me, your girl Gracie Minor, with yet another interesting video. Um, I'm so happy and elated that we made it to this far, guys. 2020 is here with us, and it is the year to make it or make it. So I'm super excited that you were joining me here on this vlog. Um, yeah, uh, as you can read from the title, um. This vlog is about my vision board. Eh? I know I'm late. Um, I've done this. Uh, we, the ear has already gone. It's so much into the ear. And I know I'm kind of late on doing this. But hey, better late than never. Um, and the reason why is because I relocated to Nairobi. And I've been trying to settle down and just trying to find my way through it. And... Yeah, so let me know in the description box if you in the comment section, sorry, if you want to know why I moved back to Nairobi or and if you want to see the journey uh, as I moved from Nakuru to Nairobi and just to say um, Kidogo on that point, it's not like I have um neglected you people from Nakuru, my people, that, that town has really been amazing. It, my stay there was so amazing. The people, the hosts there were so amazing. And I will be back in Nakuru. I have friends over there. I have people over there. So be sure to be seeing me in Nakuru from time to time. Anyway, I'm super excited that I'm finally doing this. I've never done a vision board, guys. I've never done. But I always thought that I have all these things I want to achieve in my head. And so there is no need of laying them down. But I come I came to realize that a vision board is actually quite important. Reason being we are all caught up in um days hassle like you are in your business you come then the day go by the days go by and then you whatever you had in your mind sort of fades away and now you're just working you have no visual representation of what you actually want to achieve at the end of a certain period um come come to the year's end so i thought to myself why not um create a vision board for myself this year and see how it works and actually if i will be able to um achieve whatever is on the vision board so for you guys who are wondering what a vision board is a vision board is actually a visual <laughs> representation of words or images that you want to achieve um in your life or in a certain period of time sorry um so just laying them down in a collage kind of um, form so that you can be able to simulate your brain, your emotions to work towards that goal. That said, um, a vision board should be actually hung on, okay, where you, where you wake up and you can be able to see it. Like the first thing you do when you wake up is that you see your vision board and what you want to do and what you want to achieve at the end of the year. And that will give you time to, that will give you the energy and the motivation to, to continue or to keep on moving and going. Um, sorry guys, if you hear a lot of noise, it's just because I, where I live right now is next to a construction site and I thought they had gone for lunch, but it seems they haven't. Anyway, uh, so that's just about it, you know. And um, it also forms the basis of the law of attraction. Yes, I know you've heard it over and over again. The law of attraction, the law of attraction. Um, for those who have not heard the law of attraction, is that whatever you give to the universe, the universe gives back to you. If you give out positive vibes, positive things will come on you, will come your way. If you give out negativity, you'll get back negativity. So that kind of thing. And so I'm trying to speak to the universe to give me all that I am requesting or all that I have laid down on this vision board. I hope you guys enjoy this video. And if you do, let me know. Let me know if you have if you had a vision board and if it's what if if it has worked for you, yeah? 
um and what do you have on your vision board what do you want to achieve for 2020 let me know kindly in the comment section and let's keep this interactive let's meet at the end of 2020 with if not all most of what we have laid down on our vision boards achieved so that means hard work goes into it smart work goes into it um discipline goes into it and um um, self-motivation just goes into it just need to keep on pushing and pushing let me know in the comment section if you guys have a vision board I'm super excited for this So I thought I should change you up. I think this angle is better than the other one. So yeah, after writing down the categories of the things that I want to achieve for 2020, yeah, the like this two small um things. I went online and searched for the images that matched the categories uh, of what I want to achieve or for my vision board so yeah without further ado let me go straight into it i don't want to bore you with so many words so the thing is for me this year i want it to be a very personal year sorry it has to be inverted but um for me this year is just a personal year for me and by that i mean i just want to focus on my growth just nurture that person that I am or the the potential that I have to becoming a big success um, hopefully because I know that um, yeah great things lie ahead and I can only get to them if I um, if I ready myself for them so this year is just being um, personally personally for me this is just being focused on the person I am and the potential that God has bestowed on me. And with that, uh, my theme for this year is, I will read it out. Stop letting your potential go to rest because you do not feel confident enough or ready enough. People with half your talent are making serious waves while you're still feeling, well, while you're still waiting to feel ready. So for me, this year is just, go on and get it, go on and get it. So that's me this year. This is like my, like my drive motivational quote for this year. Um, so I divided my categories and the first category is money. Yeah, got to be wise with the money. And for me this year, I just want to focus on giving tithe. Like it's been a struggle for those many years. I've always wanted, I always want to tithe money. But then again, some things just seem to, creep up when you get the money you're like let me settle this first let me settle this first i don't want to do that this year i want to tithe my money 10 percent to church and that is my aim and the other goal for me this year is just to save or invest um i'm saving sa i'm saying saving or investing because um or both you know i can save and invest at the same time or i can save or invest so that is one of the other thing that I want to do this year, uh, in terms of travel, I want to do a solo trip, guys. I want to do a solo trip. I don't know to where. I haven't chosen the category yet, but I don't know. In Kenya, outside Kenya, very hopeful, very, very optimistic that this year I will get to do a solo trip um, to anywhere, Kenya or without Kenya or Within Kenya or without Kenya? Is that correct English? I don't know. And if you know me by now, you know that I have never, never been on a plane. I know we are many. Ain't ashamed of that. Um, so this, uh, this is one of my plan. This is one of my goal. This is one of my desire just to get on a plane. And I don't want to go on a local trip. I don't know to Mombasa. No, I don't want to. I want to enjoy a good flight, like fly for some few hours. Um, so yeah, uh, I want to take a ride, a trip on the plane. I don't know. Hopefully, I will. And last but not least, on the travel section, I want to visit uh, this city. Guess in the comment section which city, which city this is. Leave 
your answer in the comment section. I don't know if you guys can see it. Uh, okay. This is the city I want to go to. And I'm very, very hopeful that this will happen. Um, so, and the next category is a YouTube. You guys, I want to grow this YouTube channel to become bigger than I imagined. To become, to reach out to so many people that this, for me, this is just a channel, um, a platform for me to just enjoy life, have an adventure, just kick out of my kawaii da comfort zone and just go just go and experience life so i hope you guys will be here to see that happen and tell your people your shoshu your guka your sisters your aunties to subscribe to this channel because i want to reach my target for this channel and that is to grow this channel to um many subscribers i'm not limiting myself i don't want to put a number i don't want to put um I don't know i just want to surprise myself this year and you guys are the only people that can help me achieve this or realize this so make sure you subscribe click on that red button that is written subscribe i don't know where it is and also click on the notification bell so that you're notified whenever i post a new video i realize that some people only hit the subscribe button but don't hit the notification bell so when i post a vi video you guys are not able to see that video not you are not notified when i post a video so when you click subscribe also click the notification bell so that is my goal for the 2020 to grow my youtube views to grow my youtube subscribers comments and everything of that sort so you guys help me do this help me achieve this and i will be more than grateful um the next step is um self-care self-care so I say this year is going to be personal and to accompany this, it will be me joining the gym. Yeah, yeah. Body goals, body goals. Anyway, <laughs> I'm really excited about this. I've been gym hunting. The gym that I wanted to go to apparently got closed down for renovation purposes. So I'm currently looking for a gym. Um, I don't want to lose weight guys. I don't want to lose weight. I just want to keep fit. I just want to tone my body <laughs> Body goals 2020 anyway, so that is one of my other um, Goal 2020 and then the other thing you guys I Don't know if you know this, but I have been struggling with um, Skin issues. I have some skin uh, black spots if you can see Yes, they they come up they are hormonal uh, once in a while like that some months the black spots seem to fade away then some other months they are really really there and um, this year I just want to go to the dermatologist like save up and actually go to the dermatologist for this because um, I've been using just off-the-shelf um, skincare products like I just go to um, beauty shop get myself some black spot clearing whatever product but they don't seem to work so that is my vision for this year just get myself a good um visit to the dermatologist for a good skin yes um the other category is going to be i'm going to dress up this year like seriously aim and purpose to just look nice when i leave the house um i'm bad at this as in I just wear what I want to. Okay, yeah, you should wear what you want to. But I want to be intentional with how I wear and what I wear and the makeup that I have on my face. Not because of anything or anyone, but just for self-fulfillment. I mean, this is going to be a challenge challenge to myself. So it's going to be shoes. It's going to be clothes. It's going to be a lot of makeup. And the motto to drive this, or the motivational quote for this, is buy that show. Life is short. Ha! So expect to see me all glammed up. Hopefully. <laughs> and the next category will be books. I want to read more books this year. I want to read more books this year. As in that is what I also want to do. Last year I read one book. For a whole year, as in, 
I will read those off. I will read. I will just procrastinate. I'm like, I'll, I'll read in the next hour. I'll read in the next, I don't know how many minutes. But this year, I just want to be intentional and read more books. Uh, and also, guys, I have a super, super slow laptop. I have a super, super slow laptop. Um, so this year, I hope to get myself a better laptop if you are out there and you want to sponsor your girl with a new laptop <laughs> anyway this i want to get myself this new first laptop i think it's a hp core i7 i don't know but anyway then the last and not the last thing on my on my vision board is going to be my company our company if you do not know me and my sister started out a company it is known as Sekani Africa Sekani Africa is a company that just deals with Ankara things that will that that suit your home that will make you happy that will make you feel satisfied that will glam up yourself because we have some really nice things I will post them here here so they aim is just to grow this company and also bring new products to you guys so 2020 20, expect bigger and more things from Sekani you guys I'm looking forward to this year I'm looking forward to um, you coming out and supporting um, Sekani yes Sekani Sekani Africa yes I will leave a description or a link to the Instagram page here on the description box below um yeah we sell this kind of things you will definitely find them in the on the instagram profile oh page sorry on the instagram page so yeah follow that as well so next is to stick these um images on a manila paper i was not able to get a good uh, frame but i'm gonna use what i have and that is a manila paper so let's do it so guys, this is the end result of the vision board. I thought I should just put my name, Grace Vision Board 2020, to just personalize it and just make it feel like it's mine, like I own it, like I need to do the things that are here. I need to pray for the things that are here so that they can be able to manifest and become a reality. So that's why I put the name Grace on top of the place, so of the, of the board um so yeah that's just about it as i finish off the video two things that i have learned when i was making this um vision board is first that you need to leave space on your vision board because things keep changing there are things that you will need to add and there are things that you need to remove so you need space um to add things that you want to add later on because life keeps changing where you are today is not where you will be tomorrow yeah so you need to leave a space for that and the second most important thing is that you need to be realistic with what you are planning for yourself do not over do not be so over ambitious do not be over ambitious uh, because if you do not achieve what you have laid out for yourself you will become demoralized and then again do not downplay your potential like uh put things that are like achievable and now you will not be able to have um pushed yourself uh, beyond your limits so two things do not be over ambitious and second thing second thing is do not limit your potential so just evaluate where you are and where you want to be and set realistic goals of where you want to be in future so with that guys that's my 2020 vision board i hope you enjoyed this video if you have kindly please subscribe to this channel uh, leave me a comment uh, let me know what you think about this video if you guys have had a vision board before and if it's worked and also like this video if you like it <laughs> and also share it out guys till next time stay positive stay woke and um God bless. Bye.